Louisiana Beer Reviews, Welch's Sparkling Apple Soda. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Beer Reviews. What should I review? <gasps> Red's Apple Ale. This 5% fruit beer, apple ale, is kosher for one thing. It's a kosher beer and it was introduced in 2012. It's an ale with natural apple flavor and caramel color. All right, and it's an SAB Miller brand or Miller Coors brand. And it gets a poor rating on Beer Advocate with just a few reviews less than 100 and 9 out of 100 on Rate Beer, 29 out of 100 for the style with not even 100 reviews. So let's see what it's like. Twist cap, of course. Some smoke. It's very foggy today. It probably is not showing up. I don't, I'll admit ahead of time I don't care for flavored beers so to be fair I have to bring that up I'll try not to be too biased biased well not much of a head a very fizzy white head that's gonna die right away like root beer or something and a clear very bubbly <clears throat> golden appearance like apple juice okay Let's check out the aroma. I mean, look at that head, it's gone. It smells like, um, like an apple wine, maybe. Apple cider. Doesn't really smell like beer, though. Let's go with the taste, but, well, let me try to describe it a little better. It's sweet, appley, and um, like an inexpensive uh, flavored sparkling wine. The taste. Very much like that also. Sweet, very sweet. You get the apple flavor. Maybe a little bit of bready malt. No bitterness whatsoever. A light and watery mouth feel and the finish is um, more like a lager, crisp, fairly refreshing and highly drinkable. Well, it's not the kind of thing I would drink or ever buy again, but I was curious to try it. It is a beer, um, um, and the a beer in the barest sense of the word, but it is a beer, and it's really made for people that don't like the taste of regular beers. Okay, so. I was talking to a woman last week and she said, oh, I love it. It's so sweet and tasty. So it is like a girl beer. And I'm sure lots of men like it too. Um, it doesn't taste bad. It just tastes like a flavored drink. You don't pick up any of the alcohol at all. So I'm just going to say for beer overall, it's... I guess it's a B because it tastes good. It's so hard to rate something like this, but I'm going to be fair and say a B because it is a good tasting thing. It's more like a soft drink, but it's alcohol, you know, it's, it has alcohol. So and if you like flavored drinks and if you like soft drinks, which, which I do like, um, and I remember drinking this Welch's apple soda. It tastes a lot like that. Except it's got the alcohol. So what can you say about it? It's okay. It's good. It's if you like this kind of stuff. I don't really. So I, that's. it's not really fair for me to say, well, I don't like this, so it's bad. 
or I don't like these type of things, so it's bad. I don't really care for these type of things, but it's good for what it is. So, Les et les bons tourmoulets. This is an unusual and not bad beer, and in fact, good for those who enjoy that. And I'm going to end this review by saying y'all come on down to very cloudy and foggy southeastern Louisiana.